From my perspective, uh, one of the most important issues is how to decrease exacerbations of COPD, and then once they occur, how to treat them better. So we have a number of treatments for the exacerbations, but those treatments aren't very good. They include inhaled bronchodilators, inhaled uh, steroids, uh, PDE4 inhibitors such as roflu melast, as well as chronic macrolide therapy. Those therapies individually decrease the risk of an exacerbation by about 15%, so they're really not very good. We need much more robust therapies for COPD exacerbations. Now, once the exacerbation occurs, we actually need better therapies for that, too. <clears throat> we have uh, antibiotics, we have steroids, we have inhaled bronchodilators for exacerbations, uh, but those therapies have been around for over 30 years. They also are associated with a, a higher risk of, of side effects, uh, in particular steroids. Uh, and when people ultimately get admitted to the hospital, they have much higher mortality rates uh, when they go into the intensive care unit, uh, anywhere from 15 to 30 percent. Uh, so we have a long way to go to improve those therapies.